Are you attracted to fems or stems? I cannot lie, I cannot lie. I do this, I do this, shit come as no surprise. Cause I get the job, don't no pressure, not playing games. I know how she moving, it's clear, we don't think the same. What's good, everybody? Welcome back to DC Productions. I'm in Cavalcier Production. It's your girl, Jasmine, aka Temptress Cavalcier, back at it again with a back at it again. I know it's been a while since I've been posting other than my music videos, which, by the way, you should check those out because they're amazing. I swear to God, they're amazing. But that's just for me. Um, but I know I'm, I promise that I will be back, um, to do something in regards to the platform itself outside of my music, but in between, in the meantime, in between time, this is what, uh, my music is all the one to be dropping. And so I found out what area I want to go in regards to getting, um, something else done on here. I am still trying to figure out, trying to wrap my mind around what I want to do. I don't want to be cliche like everybody else, but at the same time, I want to do something interesting and something that keeps people's attention. In the meantime, in between time, I'm going to go ahead and just do these questions and A's. I know you're sitting here like, why are you doing Q&A's? But um, I feel like everyone asks these random questions. It's a horror. And I post some of them on my Instagram. But I'm never really able to fully explain them because I don't want people to be sitting here reading long posts or explanations on what I'm going to do. So what I decided to do was to take um, my questions from Sahara and some random questions that people decide to DM me and put them in videos to make a Q&A. So in the meantime, in between time, I decided to just go ahead and do this. If this way, I hope that everyone will enjoy it. If you don't like it, you know, you can always comment below, but I would prefer you to tell me that you do like it so that we can get everything together and continue to, so I can continue to know if I want to do this. Um, also, with my Q&As, I've also decided that I wanted to do like a giveaway at the end. So I decided that I will either be giving away credits or gifts or whatever. It depends on what the mood is. So I'll be looking on for that to find out uh, what exactly is going to happen. Uh, so what will be the giveaway this video? Um, but in the meantime, let's jump right into it. Oh, also, if you do want to um send me some questions or you know anything you can one dm me my dm will be below um so you can dm me random questions or if you would prefer to remain truly anonymous you can hit my sahara and that link is in my um bio on my ig page as well so with that being said let's jump right in so the first question is um, gets on one knee, pulls out a ring, and will you marry me? Uh, no. I'm sorry, but no. Um, next question. I've been watching you for a minute, but I've been scared to approach you, so I'll just do it here. What are three things that no one knows about you? One, I'm kind of an antisocial person. I tend to stay to myself. And... Is mostly for my uh, insanity. Other than that, yeah. Um, two, I hate pink. Like, I really do hate pink. I'm not a pink person. Not the singer. I love pink the singer, but the color is atrocious. I cannot stand the color. Um, even though that's <laughs> someone I really care about their color. I'm sorry. And three I'm a low-key poet or artist so yeah that's another thing about me all right so the next question I fucking hate you your music garbage and you a waste of space FYI um okay one thanks for sending me a question Two, okay, you can have your opinion, just so you know. The latest 
music or latest song that I dropped, the video will be up on, just so you can check that out. Yay. And three, I'm going to need you to learn how to spell. This question is confusing as hell. Just saying. Next question. Are you attracted to femmes or stems? I'm attracted to women. So, so you got a whole baby with no father. How did you do that? Did you just get pregnant for attention? Uh, no. I don't need to get pregnant for attention. You give me attention anyways. Um, but this question was back from January. So I decided to answer it anyway again. All of my children have a father. Um, I have three. They're my little, they're my demons. Um, the first one is Dom, which everyone knows. Then there's Shay, again, someone everyone knows. And then there's Nova, and Nova's real name is Cameron Nova Lorenzo Jr. Um, but those are my three kids, and yes, they have a father in the subject. Next question, what made you go STEM? I'm not STEM, so I don't know what you're talking about. I'm a no label. What's your favorite anime or manga? Well, I haven't read manga in a while. I don't really read much manga, but the last time I read manga was back in high school, and it was Naruto. <clears throat> As for anime, I'm in my favorite anime is this French anime. It's not actually in French, but the title is French. While I can read and write French, I am not trying to butcher it. I hate pronouncing stuff in French. Um, so yeah um i'll post uh the name of the anime below as well as the picture so you know what i'm talking about but the reason why it's my favorite anime is because i love violins i have this weird obsession for violins and the way they sound i think they're really beautiful instruments i can't play um but i do feel like they're very beautiful instruments do you identify as stem now or is it just a phase i identify as human um and to answer your question no, it's, I don't really identify as a STEM, I identify as a no label, and no, it's not a phase, I am literally no label, um, what the fuck is the no label, either you're femme, a STEM, a stud, I don't, don't you think it's confusing, confusing to whom, I'm confused on who you, who is confused about what a no label is, but for those who don't know what a no label is, a no label is a person who doesn't believe in identifying as one thing, um, like a femme would specifically be feminine, a stud would fit specifically dress masculine, and a stem is like a mixture in between. I dress how I dress, depending on my mood, how I'm feeling for the day. So it is with it. So one day you may catch me as a femme. The next day you may catch me as a stem. It all depends on what mood I'm in. Um, I do have a stud abby, but I'm not very active with that stud abby. Um, it's a rare occurrence where you'll see me in the stud abby. Um, what advice would you give someone who's looking for love? Don't. <laughs> <laughs> the reason why I say that is this. I'm not saying um, don't love anybody or don't fall in love. I would just say don't look for love. Because people who tend to look for love typically always end up hurt. Um, and the reason why I say that is... Um, when you are looking for love, you anyone who's willing to give you attention, you're quickly trying to rush into a situation where you try to fall in love with this person in order to um, start something to fill that void that you have. And I don't believe that you should. I feel like you should be looking for friendship, um, family, someone to chill with, someone to kick it with, someone to hang with. And if you do fall in love eventually, hey, you do. But I mean, we can't control our emotions. But don't just randomly go looking for love. It's the easiest way to end up getting hurt. Um, since you're no label, do you date stems and studs as well? If so, who's dominant? I date women and it doesn't matter. Um, what's your favorite position? Uh, next question on my answer that. <laughs> um, how do you feel about people claiming to fall in love in days and have you ever done it? Um, I don't have. I don't feel anything about people claiming to fall in love with these. People fall in love with their own place. If you fall in love, you fall in love. If you don't, you don't. Who is who is there to dictate how long it takes for you to fall in love with somebody? I do, however, feel like people fall in lust and then assume that that's love. 
um, but that's about it. I really um, can't say, but like I said, you can't dictate who or how long it takes someone to fall in love with somebody. Have I ever done it? Yeah, uh, it didn't end well. Um, me and the person aren't talking anymore, but you know, it is what it is. Um, next question Are you single? No, no, I'm not. Are you attracted to fins or stems? I'm attack, attracted to women. And that's the end of it. You know, it's, it's not really much to explain here. It seems like everyone is really questioning about my label and my attraction to people. I just like women. That's it. Um, so, yeah, that's it for the Q&A for today. I would say these questions are very interesting. Um, but... If you want to submit questions to me, feel free to either submit them to my DM. If you want to remain fully anonymous, you can submit them to my heart. Um, other than that, the question for today is this. Um, if someone randomly asked you to marry them, would you? And the prize for that is 10K. I'm giving away 10K um, to the person who answered that. So the question is, if someone randomly asked you to marry them, would you? So that in order to uh, respond to that, you have to, one, subscribe, two, like this video, three, answer a question, and four, drop your username below. Again, just one, subscribe, two, like the video, three, answer a question, and four, drop your username below. And so the mean, in the meantime, in between time, I did enjoy this. I look forward to you all these questions in the next episode. Have a nice day.